Hey guys, Tate from Florida here. We're in Dahlonega, Georgia. We're checking out what's to be known as the world's only river diving bell that was used or experimented with for mining gold out of the Chesapeake River in Georgia. Um, in 1875, entrepreneur uh, Philogus Hawkins uh, attempted a radical new idea and made this diving bell which was lowered down by a barge and they would go down through the tube at the top and they could seal the top off once one side and then they would be inside this here and what they would do is as they would pump or they would they would pan the gold off between the the sand and whatnot on the bottom. It would filter out the gold, which would be pumped to the surface. Now back in 1875, when they used this, they didn't have a whole lot of luck with it, so they didn't use it for very long. You can tell on the front end it has a kind of a pointy end to it because they had a problem actually picking this thing up if it was just a, a regular square so they put a pointy nose in the front of it. Now this has been redone. This is the actual unit from back in 1875. And the top piece, that is new, but they did redo the original, which is this piece right here. So this would be on the top. And they would actually go through, they would crawl through this, down into the diving bell itself. And you can see the the uh, whole thing where they would pull the hatch and close it and seal it. And there's one of the hatches here. So it looks like you had to be kind of kind of skinny to get through that hole as well. And then there's the one of the gears that was used on the barge to lower it and raise it back. They just uh, finished restoring this for the last few years. So if you're in Dahlonega, Georgia, come check this out.